This is Obidilink MX Plus, definitely best ELM327 adapter you can buy and that is coming from someone who tested around 20 different ELM adapters and even more different kinds of OBD2 scanners. So OBD-Link not only it gives long warranty, you already read that, 3 years. If you buy this, I mean I know there are some cheaper adapters, but with OBD-Link you are also getting some software, so it is not that expensive in long run because you are getting access to OBD-Link app, that is very useful app for card diagnostics, for checking live data, monitoring performance data while driving. There are a lot what you can do with OBD-Link app. And then it also comes with OBDV software for laptops. So not only you can use this adapter for smartphone, you can also use it with your computer. And OBDV software is free if you buy OBD Link. So if you have some computer, you can also use it to diagnose your car problems. And then it got this pairing button. So not only it is fast, by the way, here is result of speed test, very fast adapter, but it also makes it harder for someone to connect because if you want to connect first you have to press this pairing button so no one will just connect to your adapter. Same like any ELM327 adapter you can use it with literally hundreds of different apps. So one adapter works for multiple apps for example this is app to diagnose problems with your car. I can go to these read codes I can even select which control modules I want to scan. See, and I can see why I have check engine light, I have PO342, problem with camshaft position sensor. When I start my car, see that was some rough start. <laughs> I have check engine light, but I can use my ELM adapter to get rid of it. And this is some bad sound going on. Okay, clear check engine, see, and my check engine light is gone. But then you can also get some extra data, for example you can check engine live data, check this, I can view multiple graphs at once, for example now I have oxygen sensor data, I can add, let's say RPM, let's do second oxygen sensor, and for example throttle position, and I can view all of these live data at once, which is kind of nice. If you can read these live data, they can help you find out what is problem with your car when you have some fault code. And not only you can do graphs, but you can also do this dashboard and kind of see this dashboard page. And what you can do with dashboard page like this, for some cars you might also be able to cast this page directly on your car's radio. Or you can even use it as head-up display for your car, which is kind of funny. Now even these one apps offer far more functionality than what I showed you. You can even check your emission systems. So this will tell me how ready is my car for emission test by checking emission monitors. I might have problem with misfire, fuel system, catalytic converter. So if I would go take inspection check now, I would probably fail with this car. You can even monitor statistic, do acceleration test, you can do data recording, so same like I showed you previously. Data graphs, what you can do, if you need to get some data from your drive, you can also save this data. So adapter will store all the data and once you are finished driving, you can just open file and you can see this data, so you don't have to look at your phone while we are driving. You can test it out and then you can check out how was car behaving according to this data. And like I said, this is only one app. You have different apps. Now some of them are premium apps, but there are apps to unlock hidden features of your car. So let's say I want to enable opening windows from my key fob, I can do that with another app. There are also a bunch of specific apps, for example you have app for certain brands like Opel, Fiat, other brands. You have apps to monitor one specific system. For example there is app to monitor your DPF filter. So if you have DPF filter in your car, if you have diesel, with ELM327 adapter you can see when it is regenerating. Literally there are hundreds of different apps you can use with this adapter. If you want to check them out, all you have to do is go to your app store and type in ELM327 and you can check out different apps you will be able to use with this adapter. And then also my very favorite app, if you like to do videos with your car, you can record data from car while you are driving 
and then make cool looking video like this where you have dashboard with RPM, speed and other data. I've used and tested hundreds of OBD2 scanners and the best value for money tools I categorized on my website. So whether you are looking for a scanner by car brand, budget or scanner type, you will find best options on this page and the link is in the description. And if you don't know which scanner type is right for you, I also made this free PDF that explains differences between scanner types. So you will not pay more for a scanner than you actually need to. It is free and also linked in the description.